Megan Maroney has a quick look at StockScan.com. I don't mean to alarm you or anything, but it appears that no matter what country you live in, more and more we are headed into a surveillance state. And yet, we still persist in uploading our every move and puppy video on Facebook. Why? Well, the endorphins, of course. It's what experts call the privacy paradox. We choose the immediate joy of sharing to the long-term possibility of a nefarious person using our personal information to exploit us in some way. And that is what one ethical hacker in Belgium is trying to warn us about by creating StockScan, a tool that harnesses all of the publicly available information that you have given Facebook and lets you see what you are revealing to the world. Inti Dukulaker, the creator of the tool, is quick to point out that it does not violate Facebook's privacy settings. This is simply information that you have chosen to make public on Facebook, you and me, or information that was public by default and that you did not make private. Before we take a look at how this works, you have to promise me that you will use it to find out what Facebook knows about you and to clean up your privacy act. Promise? Good. Here's how it works. First of all, make sure you have a friend check your profile to see what information is available to the public. Otherwise, if you check your own profile, you will see what is available only to you. So you have to be logged in to Facebook to see this. So I am logged in to Anthony's Facebook account, but I'm using my public profile to see what I'm revealing to the world. Okay, so here's my profile. It's loaded. I can see all of the pictures I've ever posted publicly. All of my posts all of my groups, all of my future events, all of my past events. It will show all the bars where I've ever checked in. Ooh, Barber Sellers, they make good wine. Also, I can see all the pictures that I've liked and commented on. I can see all of my friends. I can see all of my classmates. If I've ever been tagged in a photo with someone else who's single, I can click on single and then look at pictures. If you're looking to find a single person that hangs out with me, there's Burke. <laughs> he doesn't always wear that eye patch. So you can see how you could begin to create a sort of dossier, if you will, about me or anyone else. And all of this information is public. As a public service to my coworkers, I let them know some of the things that I know about them by using StockScan. It wasn't creepy at all. So you ever been pulled over? Yeah. Like in 2003 in Lewiston, Maine? Oh, <laughs> that photo. Yes. So Josh, I noticed in uh, 2011, you liked a photo of someone's breakfast and it was pancakes with sausage. And so like, I thought you were a vegan. Hey Burke, nice tattoo. Uh, how about Count of Monte Cristo? Do you, uh, pretty good book, huh? How did you know I even read that book? So that's my privacy tip for you. One way to avoid all this information being on the internet is to totally delete your Facebook account, but who wants to do that? You'd miss all the puppy videos. I'm Megan Maroney. I host Tech News Today every day at 4 p.m. Pacific and iOS Today every mm. Monday at 1 p.m. Pacific. Mm. For real though, I do like Tech News Today. That's a very good show. Thank you. Especially and when Megan I'm on. Thanks you. Mm. Special what? When I'm on, it's even better than usual.